So I'm painting my Michael Lang inspired uh, drawing now using gradients. So to create a gradient, I'm going to color one section in one color and then another section in another color. And then with a dump brush, uh, slightly uh, kind of mix the color on the page on here. Uh, so I'm trying to have different gradients in different boxes and just have a, one gradient in each section of the drawing. And I'm trying to think about how my colors uh, can contrast with the colors next to it on there. So here I've got from yellow to red, and then to blue uh, to create a little bit of contrast and then from blue to yellow uh, and so on. So I'm trying to really contrast my colors and make sure that all the shapes stand out. Uh, at the moment, I'm not using black. I'm going to keep the black until the very end on there. So if you want to blend the two colors together, uh, just rinse your brush wipe it down and with the slightly dump brush mix the colors together on your page on here uh, make sure also so your palette don't get dirty that you rinse your brush uh, when you go to a different color so for instance if you use yellow and you want to use red uh, rinse your brush in between so you don't make your palette dirty uh, now that i've finished my gradients everywhere i'm just going to add some tints uh, with some black on here uh, same principle uh, Color your area in black, then rinse your brush, then with the dumb brush, stretch the color out and mix it up on there. So I want to create a little bit more contrast and creating dark areas in quite a lot of my shapes on here. Now that I'm happy with that, I'm going to um, color the second section of my uh, drawing uh, using pencils on there. So I want to use the same technique and create gradients with my pencil. So here I'm using not only a range of different colors, but I'm also varying my pencil pressure and pressing harder. Uh, where I want the pencil to be uh, darker. So you need to layer your pencil carefully to do this. Uh, so you're starting with layers with kind of medium to light pressure and then building up the pressure as you go along to really have uh, that contrast on there. Try to work with pencils that are sharp as possible as well. Uh, so you've got uh, really some definitions on here. So same principle as before. I'm trying to color one section in one color and then change colors as we go along. On this one, I've got a little bit more of a marked outline on some of my shapes and sections. Um, and I've focused more on cold colors, uh, getting gradients with blues and green with a tiny little bit of red and warm colors on there. 